So right now, we gotta go inside Home Depot to borrow a measuring tape so we can measure the side skirt. everybody welcome back to my channel and today today we are going to talk about that side skirt that side skirt that I asked you guys last week and the response was insane like I told you guys I love interacting with you guys so I appreciate all the comments and the likes especially dude that achievement woo! I have never hit like 90 plus likes within like a week which that's one achievement for me right now so I'm really happy keep it going up keep hitting it up Follow me on Snapchat, follow me on Instagram, just like last week. A couple of you did do it, and I totally appreciate it. And one more thing, we have finally hit 500 subscribers, and I appreciate it so much because I never thought I would hit 500 subscribers, and let's keep that going. So whatsoever, we are going to go on today and get this site skirt done so each and every one of you can save some money. Let's go. So right now, I'm picking a risk. My girlfriend actually haven't got her license yet, and I got to teach her how to drive, so she's going to fuck up on the curb, but... I'm gonna try to guide her. And yeah, by the way, I did that myself too, so I won't scratch my front lip. <laughs> Go to your right. Go to your right. Slow. Hold on the brakes. Hold on the brakes. Hold on the brakes. Hold on the brakes. Slow. Yep. Slow. Ow! They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would. Ow! Now turn, turn left. Turn left. Slow. 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 Before we proceed this journey, I gotta show you guys why I'm not mad about the front lip. Because this shit, I'm smart enough. This thing is final wrap. So no matter how she scratch it or how I scratch it, I don't really care, it's not real pain. And this thing, it's flexible. It's not full on ABS, so it won't break easily. I actually dropped it on the freeway once and got it back two days later. Yeah, are you ready to drive? Yeah. We're good. <laughs> Let's, Let's go. go. I'm I freaking don't out. I'm, I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. Stop sign. Stop. I know how to stop at a stop sign. <laughs> Oops. Oops. Fucking gear is on end! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. The no. curb, the curb, the curb. I know, I know, I know how to do the curb, okay? Okay, guys, so this is her first time driving my car. She don't usually drive my car because I'm usually afraid of her, like, scraping it, scratching it whatsoever, and denting the ribs. Lame. What? Lame. I can try it, okay, I can try it, I promise. Okay, so right now we are going to Home Depot and then I'm just gonna film a little bit and see how she drives and see how it goes. Just feel confident when you're turning. Okay, because well, this your, car, my, my car sucks ass, so. <laughs> because this car, if weird. you guys know about the Mazda, Mazda actually said, like, it's supposed to help you out when you're turning corners, it makes you feel more confident. So, because she's been driving an old Civic, so it's a little bit different on the power steering part. So right now I'm trying to make her feel confident with this car. <laughs> so try it later on when you turn on turn on like each intersection. This is like the worst section to turn at though. Just There's potholes. No, they fixed it already. Oh, never mind. Okay. Never mind. Carry on. Driving with Stephanie. Am I am I turning right up ahead or left? No, or left? just go straight. Is it is it left? No, no, no. Turn straight. Go straight. Please. I know, I know. You go straight because yeah, it's past Chick Fil A. Yeah. But. What a beautiful sunny day! Ha ha! Ha 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 ha! What is so. Like, is there a haze or something? Oh, because Idaho has fires. I, what's with you guys and fires nowadays? Look at this, guys. Idaho has fires. I was talking to someone on a week and they're like, yeah, Idaho has a lot of fires. What's with all the fires thing? Fire. Now here's the parking part. Where do you want to park? I don't know. Come on. This is the first time I actually I'm calm letting her drive my car. Wow, thank you. Okay, you fucked up. <laughs> but still, at least I hope no one knocks it. Anyways, so right now. You gotta go inside Home Depot to borrow a measuring tape so you can measure the side skirt.
Yeah, we got measuring tape. Thank you, hun. Look at that face. That round tomato face. <laughs> what are you measuring? Oh, are you measuring outside? Yeah. I'm gonna think you're stealing the measuring tape. I'm just gonna hold it. You measure all the way. All the way to this side, right? Yeah. Put it straight, put it straight on top. That? No, pull it, yep. That's the way. 76 inches. Wait, how much is it? Hold it. 76 inches. Oh, 76 inches. You guys get that? See that? Is this 76 inches? Is here. That's here. 76 inches right here. Just it's gotta be a little bit more. No, we don't want extra. Okay, it's 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 75 and 7 eighths. There. 75 and 7 eighths. Exactly. All right. There. So I'm not sure you guys guessed it yet. Uh yes. The size scare is from Home Depot and it's actually a door trim. And that's a specific one that you need to buy so it can go through all the different seasons like winter and whatsoever so it can sustain. I had it for like a year so it's pretty good, it's pretty good. So we'll see. Where is it? Where is it? On the other side. Welcome <laughs> to a stranger and now she wants to take a picture with the stranger's dog. <laughs> so the boot that you guys gotta look for is called Vinyl Molding. It's supposed to go through a tough season, so you need that for your car if it rains and it goes back sunny and everything. You don't want it to break easily, so that's why I got. It's L23, right? Oh, look. Yeah. It's here. It's a cheap one, right? 965. This one, the phone, I please. think, yep, it's this one. I remember it being really cheap, so... Yeah, it should be this one. It's PVC anyways. It's written PVC. So it's supposed to stay with tough weather. So yep, we are gonna get this one. I'm gonna cut it. Both mine, right? Yeah. All right. Thank Thanks, bro. Fist bump. Oh so, yeah, the total balance is 21, 23. That's cheap, bro. So I got the VHT over here. This one, the black one, and a clear coat from Duplicolor. So right now, let's hit back the crib for reals. So I got everything prepped up, and right now we can jump right into it and get started. Make sure it's clean. You don't want any residue on top of it, else not, it's just gonna fall out the paint. So I'm gonna do two coats of primer, two coats of black paint with my BHT, and then depending on there, is it black enough for me? And then after that, we're gonna go with the clear coat, which I already have one, so I'm most probably gonna return that. So it's gonna be a fast pace, this is gonna be a jump scene, and then we're gonna see how it looks. But most of all, at the end of the day, uh, I'm most probably not gonna install it. So as you guys can see, like, because this is a doll trim over here, it's like curves. So this part of the curve, you just put it inside. You don't need to put it, you, no one's going to see it whatsoever. So this is the part of the outside that pe how people going to see on the part of the side skirt. So this is how it is, just like that. Remember to paint this part and this part over here. Just paint it all black. That's usually how side skirt will be. And like I said, the bottom, just keep it white and clean because no one's gonna see it once you drill it on. This is the screw that I use. You're most probably gonna drill it on the bottom from here, okay? So uh, all the way up to your body on your car. If it's really tough for you to drill in, you probably need a power drill to drill it in. And this is the screw I got. You can see the size over here, the length. And you probably just need seven. And this is the, pretty much the gap that I estimated with. So it's pretty much like that, you see? all the way there just make sure the one on the first and the one on the last will always be on the edge nearby around here so you wouldn't want it to flap you know 
Okay, so that's pretty much it. All you have to do is just paint it with primer and your choice of color and then a clear coat. To be honest to me is that I never actually used primer on my set skirt, the one that I hooked on already. But it's because my friend told me after that if you put on primer so the paint won't easily come off. So I just do it for the purpose of this video. But I cannot install this because I'm not planning to take mine out anytime soon because I'm totally fine with mine. So this one is just for the video, this one is just for you guys fam that have been asking me how to get a cheap side skirt like that. So 20 bucks I think is pretty cheap. You guys can do it like paint and everything even though you don't finish it, you're eventually gonna use it for something else for sure. Like I said, you got paint on the corners, on the edges here. And then here, like the curved part inside, you're not gonna see it because I put it under it there and no one's gonna see it ever again. And like the bottom, I actually never painted it. You see it's white. It's been here for a year and it's working really well. So I put seven screws on it and it hooks on pretty well. So yeah, that's pretty much how it is. Like from far, it looks like a side scrape. Anyways guys, that's pretty much it. For those who stay till the end, thank you. And also the ones that watched my previous video to come to here and ask for the side skirt video. Thank you. Thank you to the ones that dropped me likes and whatsoever. And if you do like this video, please drop me a thumbs up. I appreciate it. Drop me comments on the comment section below if you need help whatsoever. And yeah, as always, I'll see you guys at the next one. Peace. Mm -hmm.